What's the problem? Oh, I have no hairspray in? Long story. You know, usually I'm finely quaffed, but, uh, hey, what the heck? I slept on the sofa last night. Argument with the wife. Uh, I'm, I'm kidding. Um, so we got plenty of video. Video? No video. Y you didn't go buy new DVDs to record the... Wow. Okay, so we're doing the picture thing again today. Mm -hmm. Exciting. This is great. All right. You're the movie master. Make sure it's looking good. What do we do on the show today? Oh, we're talking with uh, Courtney and uh, Courtney Keeley from Fox News in uh, Cairo, Egypt, about the whole Hosni Mubarak trial. And I'm telling you, the dude looks just like... So he's wheeled in on the hospital gurney, but his hair is freshly dyed. He's freshly shaven. <laughs> it's on TV. I've seen the video. You know when you see Hosni Mubarak, and I saw just a little bit of video that you can see, he's kind of looking like Gene Simmons on that Family Jewel uh, show. And Mark Stein, who wrote the book How the States Got Their Shapes. We were talking about North Dakota and the History Channel special. And uh, he told a joke that just did not... The joke, a guy who uh, turns out the boundary was slightly missurveyed between uh, North and South Dakota. He was actually in, thought he was in North Dakota, turned out he was in South Dakota. They interviewed him on the news and asked him what he thought of all this. And he said he loved it. He was delighted. They said, really, why is that? He said, I couldn't stand those North Dakota winners. <laughs> Uh, can you hold on for a sec, Mark? Sure. We need to get cricket sound effects. Can we sometimes have cricket sound effects just standing by in case, you know, in case something like that ever happens again? Okay. <laughs> good joke, Mark. That's a good one. And our wacky Fox News reporter buddy, Todd Starnes, uh, in New York, also tried to tell a joke that did not... Why do you get the president of the United States for his birthday? I mean, it's the 50th birthday. you got to do something. You know, Carnes is not going to do. Guess what I got him? Uh, and I've, I've tweeted a photo of it. This really better be good. I got him a six-pack of Rush Limbaugh iced tea. <laughs> yeah. Hey, tomorrow morning at 710, here on AM 1100, Alice Cooper. He's in town Sunday at the uh, Blue Sam Center for the Arts. Alice Cooper, tomorrow morning. Play some for me, will you, Kylie?